Well, good morning everybody out there in YouTube land. Man, it's a good looking day the good Lord's given us today. As you can see, I'm back up here in the great white north. Thought I'd just give you a little update. Drove through uh, Chicago late last night, around midnight. Since coming through at midnight, I decided to take the 90 straight through, just go right down through downtown. I wasn't actually driving. Uh, my trainee, John, was driving. And uh, coming through Chicago at midnight in the wintertime, it was absolutely gorgeous, especially coming down 90, where you get to go right down through downtown. Got a good look at the skyline with all the skyscrapers all lit up. It was actually gorgeous. And of course, coming through at midnight, traffic wasn't too bad either. It was pretty good. As you can see, I am up here in the Great White North again. A little update. My trainee had some personal business to attend to. So uh, he needed the day off, a couple days off to attend to business. So I actually dropped him off in Chicago. That's the reason why I come out this way. I'm running a load out to uh, New Jersey, out to the Omni Bakery. Uh, if y'all seen that old video that I did a long time ago when, when I first started driving for Magnum at Omni where I filmed at two o'clock in the morning there in the industrial complex. Um, that's a wicked little place to get into, we'll just say that. So I'm on my way to New Jersey, up here running the, the Great Lakes. I'm just uh, Indiana right now, going across I-80. And it's snowing, it's always freaking snowing up here. But being from Oklahoma, we don't get a whole lot of snow. So whenever I wake up in a snowy morning like this, I, I think it's absolutely gorgeous, I love it. Makes it a little slow going getting out of a parking lot. <laughs> Other than that, it's all right. Ain't no big deal. You know, everybody worries about driving in the winter and, and the snow and ice. And, and here at Magnum, uh, we, we drive the north. Uh, this is our main traffic lane. All across the northern part of the United States, all the way to Portland, all the way to New Jersey. Of course, we run a lot of south routes too. But I like running up north. Running in the in the snow and ice, uh, you, you get used to it. Uh, you never lose your respect for it, I'll tell you that. But, but you do get used to it. It gets to be where it's really no big deal. And you learn how to judge the conditions. And if it's starting to get a little dicey, just park it. I mean, if, if you have any question about what you're running on, just park it. You can always wait till in the morning. We did that coming up uh, from uh, Tulsa, coming up to Minneapolis the other day. We come up from Tulsa up to Joplin and grab 49 up to Kansas City. Then took 35 the rest of the way up. But, uh, I was getting weather reports that it was getting pretty bad. So I pulled up my radar and looked at it, and sure enough, there was a swath right out of the middle of the United States that was getting one hell of a blizzard. So we just drove north until we hit snowflakes. As soon as we started hitting snowflakes, we grabbed first pilot and shut it down for the night. Took a good, you know, generally take a 10 hour, but took a 12 hour. Cause I didn't want to start rolling the next morning till about 10 o'clock. I wanted time for the road crews to do their business. And sure enough, by the time we got up and around that, the roads were pretty much clear. Now, people on the road were insane going through Kansas City. Went through Kansas City at about 35, 40 mile an hour all the way through it. And as soon as we got out of Kansas City, got on the freeway, interstates were nice and clean and open and we started running. We ran all the way up to uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota, no big deal. Actually got to uh, drop my load 12 hours early. So it was all good, drop and hook there in friendly Minnesota. Then run down to Albert Lee, grab this load here, it's also a drop and hook. So, so life was really 
really good. Uh, if you want an update on my trainee, John, man, he is doing most excellent. He is uh, just taking the trucking like a duck to water. He, he's going to be a good one. Quiet. <laughs> a quiet kind of guy. But uh, he, he's going to be a good driver. Matter of fact, I probably get too used to him. You know, it's this is basically his final week on my truck, and uh, sometimes I forget he's just a trainee. He, he's just really doing that well, so really proud of him. Didn't have a whole lot to say here. I think I'm going to fix me a pot of coffee. I've still got a couple hours till my 10 hour break is up. I think I'll sit here and have a cup of coffee and enjoy watching this pretty snowfall. Here in about two hours, we'll uh, keep on trucking east. Looks like we got a good uh, Great Lake effect snowfall going and I kind of expected to do this all the way through. So. No big deal. We'll get her done. Anyway, just want to jump on here and say howdy to everybody for a minute. Man, y'all have a great day. God bless each and every one of you. Remember, you can change the world. All you got to do is be nice to each other. Y'all be good. Bye-bye.